With separation, adults experience loss. We lose the person we were in a relationship with. We lose the hopes or dreams we had for the relationship. This sense of loss can affect our health in different ways. Loss of identity, loss of sharing, social changes, changes in your parental role, and changes in social activities can affect your emotional health. Loss of your sexual partner, loss of friends and in-laws, changes in the family structure, physical changes, financial and economic changes, and changes in social activities can affect your physical health. Loss of hopes and expectations, loss of routine and structure, and handling legal changes can affect your mental health. When you lose the hopes and dreams for your relationship, your spiritual health can be affected. Everyone who separates from a partner experiences many different types of emotions. You may feel depressed, anxious, like it's hard to cope, angry, guilty, relieved, afraid, out of control, vulnerable. People who are separating say that they experience more than one emotion and that their emotions are unpredictable. You may feel happy and relieved in the morning, but angry and hurt in the afternoon. Most people say they feel shaky and vulnerable. Some feel alone and depressed. Remind yourself, these feelings are normal. They will not last forever. I will survive. Sometimes parents may feel that they have failed their children and may doubt their own worth. These emotions and difficulties are often a natural part of getting through separation. Remember, feelings do not cause behavior. We have no choice about what we feel, but we do have a choice about how we act on those feelings. We can choose to respond in ways that help the children make a positive adjustment. How we handle our own feelings and how we relate to the other parent will affect how well our children adjust to the separation.